за шаг. Who is braver? A schoolboy? A businessman? A show host? Or maybe a pensioner? 10 meters platform is a very serious mental challenge. Who dares to jump? Who is going to get scared? And will everyone survive? 15 volunteers aged 16 to 53 came here today to test themselves. Watch until the end and try to guess now what percentage of people will jump. Half or maybe a quarter? We'll find out soon. Whoa! All stunts are performed either by professionals or under the supervision of professionals. This video is intended for informational purposes only. Don't try anything without a professional advisory. Hey, what's up, water crew? My name is Jim and I'm a cliff diver. I have seen so many people being terrified at the edge of the platform. I was wondering how many people who have never tried diving before would be able to jump off the highest 10 meters platform. I welcomed my subscribers to come to the pool today and to join the challenge. There are 15 participants in total. How many of them will actually jump off? And how many will smack? We are to find that out. Let's fly! All these people have completely different occupations and backgrounds. Some of them might not jump today because of their fear, but what a crew! They deserve a huge respect just for coming here today. Diana, 25, logistic operator. Natasha, artist. Oksana, military pensioner. Nastya, 28, engineer. Anna, 21, medical student. Ivan, 36, manager. Dmitry, 37, entrepreneur. Sergey, 36, businessman. Dennis, 31, attorney, Sasha, 17, student, Andrew, 26, product manager, Kirill, 31, sale instructor, Serge, 21, constructor, Jan, 39, showman, Alexey, 34, marketing manager. By the way, the requirements for the challenge are a minimum 16 years of age, absence of injuries, and of course, ability to swim. We do not want anyone to drown. We are starting with a warm-up on the pool deck. I have been diving for more than 20 years, and trust me, you don't want to skip the warm-up before jumping off huge platforms. Then I got everyone together and introduced them to the most important rule of the challenge. Do not jump if you are not completely sure. We are using the easiest technique for the jump in this challenge. To know more, watch the How to Jump Fit First tutorial. The link is in the description. Once we are up on the platforms, I'm going to count how many people will jump, how many will step out, and how many will smack. Hope there will be no bruises today. Okay, we are on 3 meters, the lowest platform. Just like I imagined. Everyone is doing great at this high. But for some, even the 3 meters looks a bit rough. Either because they do not follow the exact instructions, or because of the anxiety. Overall, I'm happy with how it is going so far. The results of the first high of the challenge are Jumped – 15 Smacked – 0 Refused – 0 Time needed for everyone to jump – 2 minutes 23 seconds. Our next high is 5 meters. Am I seeing a lack of confidence in some of the participants? Good thing that everybody is still looking brave. At first, no one had any issues with their jumps. And some of the guys even corrected the previous mistakes. But then Serge raised only one arm up in the air. He says he was debating on going in with his arms up or down, so he did something in the middle. He would be in a big trouble if it happened on 10 meters. Diana was hesitating, but after a little encouragement she went for a jump. I have to say this high went very smoothly. The results of the 5 meters are Jumped – 15 Smacked – 0 Refused – 0 Time needed for everyone to jump – 3 minutes 27 seconds. But the next high is 7 meters. I highly doubt the results will be as excellent. Okay, now it's time for the 7 meters platform. Готовы! 
The difference between 5 and 7 meters is not that great, but looking down from the edge is already mind-blowing. And I bet the anxiety level of the participants has risen a lot. One by one they started making mistakes. I had to remind everybody to keep their arms up in the air. Serge leaned back after the takeoff and slightly smacked on his glutes. He better change that on the next platform. Sasha also lost his balance in the air, but it was still acceptable. And the worst mistake happened to Anna. One of the most dangerous things to do at the edge of the huge platform is to change your mind at the very last moment. I have seen way too many smacks that happened because of that. Oh shit. Damn it. And looks like Diana is hesitating again. She jumped off 5 meters, but 7 seems too high for her. Well, everyone did quite a good job here. The results of the 7 meters platform are Jumped 14 Smacked 1 and half Refused 1 Time needed for everyone to jump 4 minutes 47 seconds Alright, this is 10 meters time. I'm warning the participants that this high is absolutely different from the previous ones. But you never know what can happen from such a high platform. And what happens if something goes wrong? You know, I have dived off 27 meters. You just don't think about something goes wrong. And the main tip for the 10 meters is to squeeze your butt as hard as you can. What a crew! Those people are heroes. I'm very nervous for all of the participants. But seeing them conquering this high gives me so much joy. Everything was going smoothly, until Jan came up to the edge. I guess he is a no-go. Do you want to see his overcoming? I'm also so worried for Serge. He has made the most amount of mistakes earlier. Ouch! And once again he was so anxious that he forgot to lean a bit forward. I am so proud of him for doing that regardless of his fears. Yet I bet he felt that hit on his buttocks. Alex was hesitating for quite a long time, but finally went for it. Whoa! Whoa! I wonder what happened in his head when he finally decided to take off. He says he couldn't let himself step out, because his kids were at the pool watching him. What a motivation! And now it is Sasha's turn, our youngest participant. Well, Nasty did a great job earlier, so I'm sure she will be fine. But now it's Anna's turn, the one who changed her mind on the 7 meters. Out of everybody, her entry was probably the least pleasant. Yet she says everything is fine. I'm so happy for her. The results of the final platform are Jumped 13 Smacked 1 and half Refused 1 Time needed for everyone to jump 4 minutes 48 seconds Anyways, it is awesome that none of the smacks today were too hard. What a crew! Now I wonder what the results would be if there were 300 participants. Comment below if you would like to see that. And please watch some other video, cheer us up with your like and subscription. And please don't do crazy stuff. We will do it instead of you. Take care. Bye.